All right, we are to our next letter of the week, and this week our letter is R. And R makes the sound er. And the way you form capital R is you start at the top, you go straight down, and then you would pick up your pencil and go back to the top, make a sideways rainbow, and then add a ramp. So that is how you form capital R. Just make sure you start at the top, go straight down, then you pick up your pencil, or if you're forming it, you pick up your finger, um, make a sideways rainbow, and then add a ramp. And then for lowercase r, you go straight down and then race back up to catch the rainbow. So start at the middle line, you go straight down and race back up to catch the rainbow. So that is you, how you form capital R and lowercase r. So just a reminder, you're going to help your child choose one homework option to practice for capital J and one homework option to practice for case day. Um, and if they pick one of the options, they don't have to do the worksheet page that comes home. If they choose to do one of the other homework options, then that counts. They don't have to do the homework, the worksheet page, but they can choose to do that. So if that's what they choose, then that's fine. Um, but they just need to choose one activity for capital, one activity for lowercase. Take a picture of them doing it and message me through Dojo, and then they'll get a color in their box. So the first option for um, R is build it with Play-Doh. So they could build capital R's with Play-Doh. They could build lowercase R's with Play-Doh. Um, make sure they build a lot of them, at least 10. Um, the next one is kind of a game. It's called Swap the R. So you'll just take, um, it can be on sticky notes. If you have a large piece of paper, that's great. Or if you want to take this outside, you could even write it with chalk. Just write a bunch of letters. Make sure you include a lot of capital R's or a lot of lowercase R's, whichever one you're working with. And have them hold a slice water. And then they can go and hit the R's when they find them. Um, the third option is cover the R's with any type of sticker. So you would write, um, and they can even write a capital R or a lowercase r on paper. Make sure it's pretty big. Um, and then you cover it with any kind of stickers. It can be, like in this picture, it's car stickers. It can even be the like garage sale stickers that are just a colored circle. Um, any type of sticker. Um, but make sure you have it wrote on a paper first and then they can just outline it. And like I said, they can be the ones to make the, the r's as the background to cover. And then final option is finish the letter R pages. Um, again, the homework seems to be going really good. The kids are excited when they come to school the next day. They ask me if I got their picture and they like to, I show them their picture and they like to see that. So um, keep up the good work. Let me know if you have any questions.